here today with the latest version of Taurus's G3 pistol. It's the G3C compact model with the uh, Toro option, which stands for Taurus Optics Ready Option. It's uh, got a little plate on the top of it here that you can remove. It's got several different plate adapters on there that you can use any number of different optical sights on here. It really works great. This is part of a new generation of 9 millimeters that uh, have really excited me a great deal. It was the uh, SIG P365 and the Springfield Hellcat. Here not too long ago I tested Ruger's uh, Max 9 pistol was real excited about that and it's become my everyday carry pistol. These are just the, the greatest thing I think that's ever happened to concealed carry pistols. It's a small compact 9mm pistol, small enough to put in your pocket if you carry for if you pocket carry like I do. I'll carry pocket almost all the time because I'm wearing overalls almost all the time so I'm not wearing a belt with regular riches and uh, pocket carry is just a thing for me and these pistols are just tailor made for it they are small they're compact they're accurate they're they have the optics option on them and they hold uh, 12 rounds in the magazine you know not too long ago they came out with the little nine millimeters pocket size nine millimeters and i carried the car cm9 for years great pistols they held six rounds in the magazine that's in you know that was very good for its time, but the latest generation of the 9mm pocket pistols just takes it to a whole new level with a compact pistol, standard capacity magazine in it. The slide is finished. It's a steel slide finished in black tenifer. Very nicely finished. It's, it's a good looking gun. Polymer frame, as they about all are any, the, anymore. They uh, strip, for those who are familiar with the way a Glock strips, they strip just like a Glock. They've got the little takedown lever here and you pull the trigger, strip it up, you know, really just, just takes seconds. It's real easy to do with no tools. There is a small section of pick rail on the dust cover right, right in front of the trigger guard, which is hooked. They, uh, they're just, uh, well designed pistol they they've got uh, rough panels on the uh, on the grip part that are just the right amount of rough they're about like skateboard tape they really are they really grip your hand nicely without gripping it to where it's going to feel like a cheese grater when you fire it they're just w very well designed with the panels on it they've got uh, indentations for your thumb on the off side on both sides and they've also got an indentation for your to index your trigger finger on when you're presenting the weapon just a very nicely done got front serrations on the slide so it makes it really easy to real easy to check your condition of your pistol and also has a loaded chamber indicator in the top of the barrel there are several different safeties on this pistol makes it a very safe pistol to own a very safe pistol to carry first of all it's got the uh, little flapper safety in the trigger and the trigger is an up upgraded flat trigger and it really feels nice and it's got a very nice pull to it also it has second strike capability so uh, you don't have to rack it every time you need to pull the trigger um, that's a nice thing to have and the trigger is pretty light it's three pounds 12.2 ounces on my Lyman digital electronic trigger pull scale it's a it's a very nice trigger a little bit of a long pull but there's not it's not creepy it's it's nice and smooth and it just works out wonderfully this pistol's also got a manual safety on the frame right where the 1911 safety will go and operate similarly up to swipe it up for safe down for fire it works great the sights on this pistol, as my brother Jeff used to like to say, are made out of a substance called steel, which is always a nice thing to have. The rear sight is uh, tapered, makes it easy to get in and out of a holster. It's uh, drift adjustable for windage, and it's uh, serrated on the back to uh, reduce your sun glare. Doesn't have any dots or anything like that on it. Just a plain black sight, and it, makes, it presents itself very nicely. On the front sight, it's got a white dot in it, and that white dot really jumps out at you when you go to present the pistol. It's easy to pick up, it's easy to shoot, easy to shoot quickly. As befits the newest generation of 9mm pocket pistols, the G3C Toro has a uh, sight plate on the top of it. It's removable with a couple of screws that you can put on a, uh, a reflex sight or a dot sight of any, any kind. There's a whole lot of different dot sights will fit on here. Uh, thanks to the, there are four different adapter plates that's provided by Taurus with the pistol. 
So you can pretty much mount just about any side on the market. I saw a list of them, and it's a long list. It really is a, a, a neat way to put an optic on your pistol because it's easy and it's cheap because you already get stuff for it. But also when the plate removed, it sets just a little bit lower down. So your, your uh, index is just a little bit better. It just it works great on these. I choose as this is a pocket pistol for me. If I was going to belt carry this, I probably would have an optical side on it. But I pocket carry it, so the pockets only got room for so much stuff in it. So I, I won't be mounting an optic on this one. But it is a nice option to have. The magazines for the G3C Toro were unloaded. Are 12 round magazines, double stack mags, and uh, they. They're made out of steel. They're very well-made magazines. They're great magazines. They work wonderfully. Uh, speaking of working wonderfully, I hadn't had any any problems with failures to feed, failures to fire, failures to eject. No kind of failures of any kind with this pistol and a variety of ammunition that I tried in it. The magazines on these are available either in a 10 round or a 12 round configuration. These are the 12 rounds because I live in the free state of Tennessee. In those jurisdictions where uh, your government thinks the difference between a patriot and a terrorist are two rounds, well, if you're living in a communist state like that, you can get a 10 round version of the magazines. Thankfully, the 12 rounds are just fine. They work just great. I've got a really neat little holster here for this pistol from ccwbreakaways.com. It's their skin tight holster. They're made in America and they're really an ingenious patent pending design. They are a very thin layer of Kydex and I normally hate Kydex holsters, but in this application, these are really neat. It's very thin layer of Kydex molded to a pistol. They make them for a small frame or a medium frame semi-auto. Hopefully they'll get one for a J frame out for too long. But uh, they've got a thin layer of Kydex that's folded over like a clamshell. And then they've got this little uh, layer of rubber, thin rubber on the outside. The holster basically weighs nothing. It adds no bulk to your pistol. It fits very well. And it goes, it, it, they're made for carrying like in a vest pocket or something like that. But they work great in my back pocket, which is where I carry my pistols. Because they, they're not bulky enough to where they take up your whole pocket and keep the pistol from rotating around inside your pocket in that manner. What these do is that rubber grabs either side of the cloth on your pocket and it works great. It keeps the pistol orientated in the proper direction so it's not pointing in a different way. You're not spending the last few seconds of your life fumbling for where your pistol is. It's great and it also it's got a sight track molding into the top and it also when you try to uh when you go to when you go to pull your pistol out of your pocket the the uh the rubber grabs your pocket the pistol stays in there you come out with just a pickle pistol not the holster also when you're trying to spend the last few seconds of your life plucking your pistol out of your holster once you get it out of your pocket these things work work great they're ccwbreakaways.com they're only about 25 bucks and it's it's money very well spent they also another neat little thing about them they they have an ambidextrous they ambidextrous holster because there's no reason not to but they have an index bump so when you go to access your weapon you put your finger on an index bump and then when you pull the pistol your finger is on the slide it's not on the trigger it's a really neat way to think it out from ccwbreakaways.com Double Taps 115 grain lead free all copper hollow point is an excellent self defense load another dandy load for social work is from our friend Tim Sundles at Buffalo Bore Ammo it's their 124 grain jacketed hollow point plus P plus Dandy load. A great all-purpose practice round is Federal's American Eagle 124 grain full metal jacket. A 
Another cool thing about the G3C Toro from Taurus that you don't see on a lot of the smaller 9mm pistols is that they are rated for plus P ammunition. It says so right in the manual. Uh, at any of the Taurus 9mm are good for plus P ammunition. So that's always a nice thing because when you're carrying uh, when you're carrying ammo to save your mama's favorite boy, you want to try to get some powerful ammo if you can. The Taurus is up to the task. The Taurus G3C Toro retails for $408.77 as of this date with that price being retail price if you can find one which nowadays the hard the hard part is finding one but uh, you can probably get it a little bit cheaper than that they're great little pistols at a great price to find a taurus dealer in your area click on the dealer finder at lipsy's website lipsy's.com lipsy's is a big distributor down in uh, baton rouge louisiana they are they're a great bunch of folks and uh, they've got a dealer network all over the country so on their dealer finder you put in your zip code and they'll tell you where there's a dealer in your area that can get you one of these to order one of these online check out our friends at Davidson's uh, Davidson's is a big distributor in Arizona and uh, they've also got a uh, nationwide network of dealers and they've got a thing on there it's called the Gun, uh, Gun Genie that you can uh, tell you know, give me your location and every zip code and whatnot and they will have dealers in your area contact you to uh, competitively bid on selling you this pistol or whatever it is that you're looking for it's a great way to buy guns either through lipsy's or through davidson's because you don't cut out your local dealers especially with things being as they are now with us being beset on all sides by the forces of evil and anti-freedom uh, it's a good idea to protect your local dealers and to support them every chance you get as long as they're not crooks. Some of them are, and if they are, they deserve to go out of business. But most, most of the dealers are mom and pop outfits. They're good outfits. They deserve our support. So when you buy through Davidson's or you buy through Lipsy's, you are supporting your local dealers also. Davidson's has a thing, but whenever you buy a gun through them, you get enrolled into their Davidson's Guaranteed Program, which basically is a, a lifetime warranty over and above any manufacturer's warranty. And uh, if anything ever goes wrong with it, they'll send you another. It's that simple. No questions asked. They're just they're real good to deal with on that. Taurus has a great lifetime warranty. And uh, they had sort of over the past, I don't know how many years, it sort of developed a reputation for not servicing their customers very well. But they have really made a focus to make that one of their main things that they're really working hard to service their customers i don't think you'll have any problems with your taurus products i never have i own a bunch of taurus pistols i've never had an opportunity to avail myself of their customer service but their customer service is greatly improved from what you might have heard from the experts on the internet the taurus g3c toro pistol is the latest in the latest generation of small compact optics ready uh, full capacity nine millimeter pistols they're made for carrying they're made for personal defense they're made to save you and your loved ones from things that go bump in the night they're great pistols it's a great concept for pistols i'm really glad that the industry has proceeded in that direction the folks at taurus have really come up with a winner on their g3c toro